A final thing to ask you about, uh, Jarlett Burns is going to take over as GA president. Uh, like Obviously, he won the vote there. What are your thoughts on him getting the job? And then also, uh, Don Lowe Cusick was talking about maybe he's not really, hasn't put any focus on hurling. But I know I saw Jarlett Burns down in Temple Stadium last year. His his daughter, I believe, is married to Dio Keefe, the Wexford hurler. And he was down to see St. Anne's in the county final before that as well. So I don't, I'm sure he has some interest in hurling for sure. Of course he has. I mean, it's uh, that would be a rather silly thing to say at this stage. I mean, Jarrett has just uh, was elected a couple of weeks ago, and uh, it is generally the, the uh, an Uther on Tuffle will generally stay in the background. and will not uh, make too many comments. Now I know that he was he was in he had committed to doing a, a sky dive for Armagh GA there recently, and uh, there was a bit of a press briefing that day, and I think he probably realised he was uh, he was ambushed a little bit there. But he he's he will stay in the background. Now he will uh, make uh, attend to hurling in the same way. As any of us would have done. I mean, uh, hurling is 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 not in a bad state today. I mean, there's there's the structure of the competitions is very good. That's not going to change. I mean, we always want to see new teams coming forward. And uh, if there is positives, it is to see the likes of Kildare, the progress that they're making. The disappointments is that Leash are not con- not kind of moving up a bit. They're just uh, have gone into a bit of a rut at the moment. I'd be disappointed with that as a county. I. I have a I have a bit of a fondness for knowing a lot of the players over the years, and I'd like to see them making headway. And uh, but I think you could see a very good Joe McDonough championship this year as well, and I'm looking forward uh, to seeing that. And uh, we're going to have some uh, cracking games. Even this coming weekend, you have Kildare playing Offaly, uh, which is a game uh, worth looking out for. Now, unfortunately, from Offaly's point of view, they've lost Oshin Kelly to a dreaded crucial ligament injury, which knocks him out for the second time in in, uh, in a couple of years. So that's terrible bad news for for him and for Offaly. But I'm looking forward to see how that game pans out because it's uh, they're the top two and uh, you know one of them will get to the final and the other one will I think play off with Kerry to see who who makes it in opposition. So those counties have been making decent and I've seen done that very sad and Christian has been competitive. So all of those grades are are are, are see hurling in a decent place and I'm quite sure when Jarrett is in a position to uh, to start uh, commenting, which he won't until he takes over after Barry. You know, he will certainly pay attention to hurling. So I have no fears on that front.